today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa and I'm a cruelty YouTuber that does a lot of makeup content. As for right now, I'm having a knob like you the week on my channel. It's day number four in this week and it's time for the fourth palette in the cutie line. It was going so great, so great and I messed it up. So yeah, <laughs> this is the Metropolitan and I love <laughs> the front of this palette. Mostly because of this little ghost. I don't know why, I just love that little ghost and the palette looks like this. And I am not in love with this palette, if I'm going to be honest. But maybe and hopefully we can change that today. I will do a halo eye today. And I don't really know, but I think I have decided. I think I want to take this Lord, the dark brown one, and the solution, this one, it has a little bit of like duochrome to it, a little shift to it. And I think it just are going to be these two colors that I will use. I don't know if I will use Love Resine as well. I don't know, but I'm going to prime my eyes and then we get started. Okay, so let's just do this halo. So I will start with Lord and the outer part and the inner part. And we will see. I usually don't take a shadow in my crease when I'm doing halo eyes, but I think I would want that now, but like I don't have anything in this that would go good. So I actually think that I will take Lord or when I put it on, I will take a blending brush and try to get it a little bit in my crease. And we will see how that will go. Okay, this is really, really dark. I think they are really good, like, overall. These palettes were doing really, really dark matte shades and really like pigmented ones. Because like, do you see this? It's really, really intense. I don't think I will do more than that. I will just try to not get too much in here. Okay, so I will take my blending brush and we will see now how it looks if I only take this. I have so many things in front of me. Yeah, something is going on at least. I think I might. Okay, do you know what? I'm doing something that I might regret. I'm dipping in to the brown shade. Just a little bit on my brush and then tap it off. And then with the easy, easy hand going in in my crease. And I fucked this up. And I'm like getting annoyed with my eyelids. It's starting to be a little bit of a problem to get it even up here, I guess. Because I'm getting older. Hopefully I can hide it with the shade I'm going to take in my halo. And yeah, the halo is shrinking and shrinking and shrinking. Okay, so I'm going to try to mess it up the same way on this eye. Maybe I should just have gone in with the shade in my crease from the start. But apparently... I did not. I think I maybe should have taken a smaller blending brush than this. But yeah. Hopefully I can hide the most things with taking the glitter primer and just cut out the halo. Okay, so I will take my glitter primer because I really want 
to have control over this halo. I don't mean that I will have control just because I'm cutting the halo, but hopefully, hopefully yes. So I'm going to cut the halo and then I'm going in with this dissolution in the halo. So we will see. Now I might need a closer mirror and might need to be a little bit focused. Okay. Now I'm going in with the solution. It feels like this is getting such a neutral lid. But if you have seen my the second video for this week that I did with the coral palette. I did a really pink look and I didn't want to do one more pink look because even though it may not show I want to try to do these looks a little bit of different from each other yeah, I do like this shade but I don't know like <laughs> what I feel about this halo. So I'm just going in with the dark matte shade and blending a bit. And I'm tapping it off because this was so pigmented. Okay, so I really like this. I didn't cut the halo like all the way up here, but I put the shade up there so it's get like a good fade. A good fade. So yeah. I think this is a good halo. So now I'm just going to try to do the same thing on this side. Okay, I think I somewhat succeeded. I think I somewhat succeeded to do the same on this side. And so far, I like this halo. It's not the most fun halo, but at the same time, I really like the shade I have in my halo. So I am going to fix my base and my brows and I think I actually will take this pink as an inner corner highlight, so a matte inner corner highlight. I think I will do that. So I will fix everything and then I come back with the finished look and we will see do I take the pink or do I not take the pink. The look is done and do I like it? Yes I really do. I put this nothing personal in my inner corner and I love what it gave to the look. It made it so much more fun. And for my waterline, I used Fluff. Is it Fluffy? Yeah. It's a new pen from Colourpop, so the name isn't stuck yet. Um, this is Fluffy from Colourpop. I think this was the Powerpuff Girls. And on my lips, I used Kernel from Nabla. And I, I'm really pleased with this look. And I think the pink in the inner corner really made it look much more fun. So I... Let's use three shades. It feels like I'm using three shades in all the palettes. So I used Lord, Dissolution, and Nothing Personal. And I think this is a really, really good look. So maybe I start to like this a little bit more. Because first, when I was planning on doing the Halo Eye, I was thinking about doing Alaska in my inner corner. But that felt... I, I think the look is much more fun like this. And tomorrow, let's go to think about it. It is time for Wildberry. I think this is my least favorite of the cutie palettes. It looks like this. But I actually think what I want to do with this, and I hope it will turn out great. But we will see <laughs> tomorrow what I think. So, this is my look with the Metropolitan, and I really hope that you will like this video as well. And so far it's just been so fun to play with my cute palettes and uh, also all the chic products I use are from Novel as well this week and the lip products. So if you want to know anything about this chics, just check down in the description. And yeah, I guess <laughs> that is all. So I really hope you liked this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!